let's take a look at identity-based processes within and between groups. Once people perceive themselves to be members of a group, predictable processes begin to develop. Differences between groups on characteristics distinguishing one from the other are accentuated so that other groups appear to be more different from each other than they actually are. They're often perceived in stereotypical terms, especially negative ones. Motivational factors may also produce this perceptual bias. For example, it's easier to behave negatively towards others who are seen as depersonalized and as all alike. In employment settings, these intra and intergroup effects often occur among work teams, departments, or parts of the organization, different locations, or other organizational subgroups. Often, the most challenging group identities are those based on demographic characteristics. 